Hello! If you are planning on joining us at Mistake on the Lake 4 for the Pump It Up XX tournament, you will be asked to take the intake questionnaire, and one of the things that it asks for is about your rank title. If you have no idea what this is talking about, please do just tell us what your preferred difficulty is when you play Pump. Otherwise, let's find out more about those titles. These are the requirements to gain the titles if you would like to get more in the eight weeks or so we have before the event. And depending on what the hardest level is that you can clear, you will be asked to play a different song for the qualifier. It does not particularly matter that you get the greatest score available on these songs. We would like to know what the appropriate difficulty is for you to play. If you do not know what your best title is, you will have to come back to this website, piugame.com. You probably used it when you set up your card in the first place. It'll ask you to log in. Checking under my info, you have a, a screen where you can see all the titles available in the game if you are have gotten them. Scroll down a little bit, you get through the intermediate, advanced, expert and these ones right here would be expert four and the master if you have them based on what the highest level is that you're able to clear you should find one of these songs please play it and send it in it does not have to be played on xx it can be played on older versions or on simulator games as long as they use the standard scoring, which is currently the case on Step XX. Have fun with it. All right, if you, I mean you, are a DDR player that does not play Pump on a regular basis, and you are trying to fulfill the requirements to join the Pump It Up tournament at Mistake on the Lake 4, you're gonna to need to know how to get around the menu, so let's do that real quick. If you are using an AM pass, looks like this. It could look like a number of other things. There's a lot of decals on it, but they look like these. Uh, you can only do it from this screen. This screen needs to happen. It's after you put a credit in and before you hit the middle button. If you are not using one, you will be sent to basic mode. Basic mode doesn't really do much for you. So instead, you will need this code. You can make her be quiet. You need this code. The way that you put in this code is you just walk across the pad and back. It looks like this. It can also be put in on the buttons, but the buttons are a little bit confusing, so I wouldn't try to do it on the buttons. Uh, the way that the overall structure of it works is there are menus within menus. The songs you are looking for for the qualifiers are most easily found by going to the top menu and sorting by the series difficulty. You could also find them by going to the individual song difficulties, but it's much easier to just go to the series. Most of the songs can be found in the Fiesta to Fiesta 2 folder. That looks like this. In here we are looking for Pop the Track is on the left somewhere. Pop the Track is here. It is 85 out of 105. Uh, we are also looking for Hungarian Dance and Native. Those should both be right at the beginning. Right? Thought I saw it. Hungarian Dance is 28 of 105, Native is 30 of 105. This is the most simple way to find these songs. Uh, if you are looking for... Chopsticks Challenge, that one's very easy. You'll go in the NX to NX Absolute and it's the third song around. If you are looking for Dignity, you will go to the Exceed to Zero folder, and it is the second song available. After you put a credit in, 
You have the ability to use a card if you want to use a card. Pulls up your profile in a little bit and it allows you to skip the step of using the full mode code. It also gives you the ability to get into the menu. You get into the menu by hitting the blue notes alternately. Just do a drill on the blue. You may also use these buttons on the cab at any time, left and right, function the same as these blue notes. Uh, if you do not know what the speed mods do, just go to auto velocity. Go to auto velocity, make it the same as your speed mod in DDR. It'll come out pretty close. There is a option in display called BGA Dark. You would like to have that on at all times. The BGAs can be very bright and very distracting in this game, and that tints the background so that you can see. Uh, unless you have a really good reason not to, you should use it at all times. There are a lot of note skins available. Hello. There are a lot of note skins available. Uh, most new players use this one. It is the old note skin or extra note skin. If you do not select any note skin, you will get the default one for uh, Pump It Up XX, which is also relatively readable for most players. But if you need to come in here instead of note skin, this is the one you're looking for. It says old note. It should be the second one available. Uh, path will be disallowed for Mistake on the Lake 4. Uh, it affects both players, and that creates an unfair advantage. Uh, so you will not be allowed to use this at all. You don't want to mess around with alternate unless you know what you're doing. This is mirror. This is random step. Random step is like super shuffle. Uh, you don't want these, but if you do want them, great. Judge is not allowed. Sort does nothing. All right. We're done. That's everything. Sorry, one more thing for you. The easiest way for people to prepare for this event is probably to come in here and mess around with a lot of these. For low level players, it goes all the way down to 10 to 12. For higher level players, you can find people pretty often in the 19 to 21 folder. Very, very rarely do you actually find anybody willing to take matches in single 22 plus, but you can occasionally hit some people generally at night. Double has almost no people in it, so I would suggest trying out these. But this will make you try a lot of different charts, pick the level that is appropriate to you, play some people online, meet fun opponents, have fun with it.